everyone, it's Barbara at BC Sells. Welcome to my home, welcome to my channel, and welcome to my Trunk Club unboxing and try-on. All right, so normally, let's see, I think most people know what Trunk Club is about. If you don't, I will tell you quickly, they have a $25 styling fee, you go online, you fill out a style profile, and you actually get to communicate back and forth with the stylist that is selected for you. And then your stylist will send you up to 12 items to uh, for you to determine if you wanted them to send them to you or if you want to decline them. And if you decline any of them, you give your stylist an opportunity to replace those items with something of their choosing. And they will send them to you and you don't know what they are. So there's no preview until you get your trunk. And the styling fee is $25. That $25 is applied to any purchase that you make from that particular trunk. And if you are a Nordstrom card holder, your trunk doesn't cost you anything for the styling fee. They give you a credit. So um, it's been a pretty good box for me overall. It's one of my favorites. Um, my stylist gets me. I mean, there's, you know, she kind of tries to push the envelope a little bit sometimes, Hannah, but you know, it gives you an opportunity to try things that you normally wouldn't try. Actually, this shirt is from one of my trunks. I love, love this shirt. This is by Rachel Parcell, and I wear it all the time. Love it. It's easy. Um, I wash it on delicate, and I, hang it, I lay it out to dry. It's just very easy. So, uh, what else can I tell you? You have five days to make a decision. If you need an extension, just give them a call and they'll give you an extension. Uh, let's see, what else can I tell you? I, uh, I think I declined just a few items in my trunk. So there's things in here, I'm, I'm not sure what they are, but we'll take a look. So Trunk Club gives you this nice little folder. In here, there is, what is there? Make sure it's in here. A list of everything that's in your trunk, a note from your stylist, and a return prepaid envelope or label that you just put everything back in that you don't want back in the box that it came in. They give you tape, tape it up, drop it off at UPS or call UPS and have them pick it up. Or when you check out on uh, Trunk Club's website, they'll give you an option for them to schedule the pickup for you. So I like the customer service of Trunk Club and it is one of my favorite boxes that I look forward to. All right, here's the thing. Everything comes individually wrapped. So I'm going to unwrap these and come back, give you a quick just kind of show and tell, and then we'll do a try on. So I'll see you in a few moments. Okay, everything's out of the plastic, and I am really excited that I received a pair of shoes, actually a pair of boots, and a pair of jeans. And I requested those because I thought that I would be back into some regular shoes by now, but I'm not, I'm still in this darn surgical boot, so, but I'm gonna try them on. I am going to try the pants on, and the pants that I received are Curves by 360, it's this um, gray color. Curves 360 by NYDJ, and they look like they, I don't know if that's a straight leg or a skinny, it's got the cute little slit on the side, which I like. Um, hopefully I can get these on and I normally, normally the curves 360 don't fit me right, but I've been down and out for four months. So this body has kind of shifted. So these might be perfect. So I'm excited to try these on and the shoes. I got a pair of shoes. These are by, who are, oh, they're a wide, oh, they're a wide calf. I'm not a wide calf girl. So these are by uh, Bella Villa Vita Boots. Yeah, well, we'll try them on, you never know. I'll only be able to try one on. Oh, these are cute. Look at these, with the buckle, the, the smaller heel. I like a heel, I usually like a heel a little bit taller than that, but actually just getting back into shoes pretty soon, I hope. Um, that's probably going to be a good height for me. They're not real pointy, but they're not rounded. They're a little pointy. And then the zipper on this side, they're black. Like the little detail. 
Hope they work. I'm ready for some new shoes. Okay, next, oh, this is by J. Crew. It's a nice knit crew neck sweater. This is, is navy. Look at the knitting on it. All right, this I will need to wear something underneath it, but for the try on, I probably won't put anything on because that means me tracking back upstairs to get something. <laughs> Very pretty. Nice, simple top, sweater, lightweight. Hope that works. Okay, this is by Tommy Hilfiger. She keeps sending me Tommy Hilfiger. I mean, I'm not a huge big fan of Tommy Hilfiger. It's just a couple things that I've received from her. I have liked, but she thought of me for this. Nice little V-neck. Uh, this is a kind of like a blue navy color with the solid V-neck, which is nice. And it continues on to by the wrist, which is nice. So this is kind of like an ombre effect, I guess. Lightweight, which I like. Okay, we're off to a good start. Okay, this is Tommy Hilfiger also, okay? I'm gonna be quite honest with you. I am not sure about this one. Uh, let me show it to you. Oh, it could be cute. I like that the stripes go across and then it's, um, and then they're vertical, the tie. I don't know. At first, when I saw this, I was like, oh, no way. So that's stripes there, here. It's kind of a little bit stretchy material. Looks like it's long sleeves. I don't know, it could be interesting. Did I tell you it's Tommy Hilfiger? <laughs> yeah. Okay, what's this one? This is by, this is cute. Who is this? Hollingen. This is a crochet front. This is, looks like it's black and it has a lining in it. And then the sleeves are see-through with the lace. And then the back is solid with, it looks like a two button closure in, around the neck. So that looks interesting. I, mean, I could see this as being able to wear it dressed up or dressed down. I'm a very casual girl. I mean, we are not fancy people at all. And I'm retired, so I need casual things that just to change it up, you can add some different jewelry, put some different shoes on when I'm allowed to wear shoes. You know, I like to wear heels, throw some heels on and a nice jacket and out the door you go. What's this one? This is Rachel um, Parcel. Same style I have on. Well, not really, just the same. Another lace sleeve. Looks like it's black. Solid at the cuff. Looks like just a rounded neck. And it's cute. Dress it up, dress it down. I need to get some belts. I need to get some kind of different types of belts to wear to kind of dress up my clothes. Okay, this is, but I don't think I've had anything by this one. Um, Bowden, B-O-D-E-N, is that right? Bowden, Borden, Bowden, I would say. Okay, this is interesting. Looks like three-quarter sleeve. It looks navy with the shimmery. It's like a jersey um, material. And it's like this gold, shimmer gold on it. Could be interesting. Okay. Try that on. Oh, this CC. CC is another brand that I really like. Okay, this might be a little too fancy for me, but well, I don't know. It could look cute with jeans. It's got more of the three-quarter sleeve, little tie at the. I've been noticing these ties a lot more when I'm watching ads um, for all the different department stores and that. So cream color, black trim. I guess it's black. It could be navy. I think it's black. We'll go over the prices at the end when we do a quick review and everything will be in the description. So if it's something that you wanna request or you wanna buy for yourself, another Rachel Purcell. Um, Purcell. Okay, this is the exact same style I have on. <laughs> when this style goes out, when it goes out of style, I'm gonna have a lot of tops to get rid of. All right, I love this style, I really do. And this, so this is more of a sweater 
V-neck. It's really the same style I have. It's just a heather gray. It's really soft. So, okay, let's get to the try-on. I have the jeans on. I actually got them on and they actually fit and they fit very well. So, Hannah, you are a very good stylist because when I first saw these jeans and saw the size, I'm like, there, there is no way, but they fit perfect. So, but let's, let's jump up to the top first. So I wanna show you the top. This is the top by Cece. It is really cute. It is very, very cute. I do like it. I like the length of the sleeves. I like the detail around the cuff. Um, it actually has a little scallop on it. I'm not sure if that's coming through the camera. And then the neckline with the bow. I actually like the bow. Okay, so, and I love the color, obviously. All right, the uh, bottom of the sweater, it is also, it's got like a, oh, just like a solid hem, I guess. I don't know what you would call it, but it's very cute, very, very cute. It's comfortable, it feels nice. I would wear this casual. I throw this on with a pair of jeans and you know, put on a jacket to go out at night or something. All right, let's talk about these jeans. These are the Curves 360 by NYDJ. This is a gray and they fit me, I'd say perfect. All right, I put a high heel on with this. Okay, the boot obviously, um, just to see how it would wear with a small heel with the slit at the bottom, which is nice little sexy kind of look. So you can dress it up with a, with a heel. Um, I think the jeans fit me very well. I can feel the stretch in them. Okay, so I've been pretty much down and out for four months and this sweater is not gonna work for me because when I just relax and I'm just myself, this is what happens. Yep, that's what happens. So to do a sit down on this, this is all gonna hang out over here. So I need shirts that's gonna kinda help conceal that until I start getting active again. So for now, you know, I don't know. Do, do I just size up maybe and hope that it's a little looser? I don't like flowy tops. I like fitted tops, but I have to have something that's gonna conceal this. Now the high rise jeans are a help. These are high rise. There's no way I can wear anything other than high rise right now. And this isn't bad. It's just, but it's there. And if I can conceal it, I'm gonna do my best to do that. So this is cute. Do you guys like this? I don't know, I think it's pretty cute. All right, I'm gonna leave the jeans on for the rest of the try on. Let's try on something else. I'll be right back. J. Crew sweater. All right, I ran upstairs and grabbed my cami to wear underneath it. Just to get a better idea of how see-through this is. You can kind of see through on the arms. I love the detail of this. It's a the, the sweater's a little scratchy, I have to admit. But it's just a really pretty, simple sweater. Again, you can dress it up or dress it down. I put on a pair of a tennis shoe with it. Change it out and put heels on. There you go. All right, this is really cute. It's just, you know, a rounded neck, navy. I have to tell you, the longer I wear it, the scratchier it feels, but it sure is pretty, very pretty. Okay. Let's try something else on. Okay, I've been intrigued by this shirt. Not sure how I feel about it, but when I put it on, I mean, it fits well. I like the that it's just different. It's a very stretchy material, and I think this is navy. Pretty sure it is. Um, the neck is a little high. Usually necklines don't bother me, but this one is just feels a little, like it's just not laying in the right spot for me. I love the concept of this top. So 
So it unties here. I don't, um, I don't know. I'm kind of on the fence with this. What do you guys think? This kind of reminds me of one of those things, you know, those baby carriers that you wear. That's what my mind keeps going to on this. I love that it's different. It is a interesting piece. Um, hmm, kind of on the fence. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let's see what's next. This is the other uh, Tommy Hilfiger shirt. Okay, this is pretty cute. I wasn't sure about the stripes, but I think it's really a nice top. I like the colors, I like the V-neck, I like the detail that's different on the V, and then the same with the uh, sleeves. It's got a little stretch, and also down here, it's solid. And I like how the stripes are really shrinking my waist. I don't know, I think it's pretty cute. If anything, it's a little small. I would probably size up because it's really kind of tight in through here. So I think the next size up would actually work better for me. Looks good with the gray jeans. Let me know what you think. Excited to try on the next shirt. Oh my gosh, I love this top. I love, love, love this top. This is by Hologen. I, oh my gosh, I love that it's just different. I would wear this with jeans, yes I would. Uh, but I would wear it with heels, probably not gym shoes. Um, it is so cute. Okay, it is lined in the front and it's not loose. So it's almost like the lining is what's also in the back and then the lace just goes over the top of it. All right, let's get a, let's get a close. Let me back up and show you the full view. What do you guys think? Okay, this is a barber top. I, the neck is not bothering me, surprisingly. Well, not surprisingly, because usually necks don't, but this one is, um, it's not the stretchy, yeah, I think it's the same stretchy material that's in the back, is around the neck, so it's kind of loose. The lace is so pretty. I mean, just the solid here with the lining, and then it's see-through here, and the see-through sleeves. I mean, and then the solid here on the wrist is the same material that's in the back. Look how pretty, do you guys like it? I don't care if you like it or not. This will probably be a keeper, I think. I have to watch a video back and hear what you guys think. But look at that, look at the detail and the front here. So it's, you know, it's got the wider spot there. Here, this one catches my eye like almost like it's ripped because you can see it more than this one. But, and then up here, and I have a nude bra on underneath it, which I think works, works fine with it. Maybe even a black one. I like the fit, I like how long it is. It feels nice. What do you guys think? Depends on the price though. I don't know what the price is. So we'll take a look at that. Okay, <laughs> let's see what's next. Another cute top. This is by Rachel Parcell, and I'll tell you, I love this one too. It looks a lot like the one I just had on, but it's a little different. Oh my gosh, I love this. Um, it's just got the simple neckline. Um, this, uh, it's got a little bit of stretch in it, and then the sleeves, look at the sleeves with the lace, and then the cuff is a solid. They feel a little short. They keep wanting to go up, but I think I'm mostly feeling like where the lace ends to meet the cuff. But, oh my gosh, I hope this isn't too pricey. Nice, simple, I would wear this with jeans. Throw on a pair of heels or a pair of boots and out the door you go. Oh. It's one of those things that if I breathe, the stomach starts popping out but when you wear black, you don't see it as much as when you wear the cream or the whites. Yep, and if I put a jacket on, 
Just make sure I don't sit too long. Just kidding. Um, I, don't, I like it. What do you guys think? I hope it's not too pricey. Um, I don't know. Like it, like it. Look at the lace again. Okay, let's see what's next. Okay, this is the top by Bowden. And it is really pretty. Another very cute top. Look at, I mean, it just looks different depending on where you're standing, how you're looking. It's got a little bit of a shimmer. It's, I don't know, it's pretty interesting. A very interesting top. Let me show you the front and the back. Three-quarter sleeve. It's an interesting top. It really is. It feels like it's got stretch in it, but it feels like it needs to stretch just a little bit more. But I don't know. Now that I have it on for a while, it feels fine. But when I first put it on, I was just kind of tugging with it and moving it around because it just wouldn't kind it wouldn't give but there's stretch in it I don't know it's kind of cute depends on the price I might need to go up a size oh it's got the boat neck I love this type of neckline um hmm, it feels maybe it's just a little small this one's a little too small for me maybe that's it I don't know but it sure is I like that it's interesting I like that it's different I love, like I said, the neckline. Hmm, what do you guys think? Okay, we have one more shirt and then the boots. So I'll be right back. I am loving this. I, I just, I don't know, I love this style. This is a good style for me. Okay, Rachel Parcell, again, is exactly the style that I had on in the beginning of the video. Um, but this is a sweater like a, um, kind of like a softer type sweater than the shirt I had on. Looks nice with the gray jeans. Um, the V-neck I like. The color, I'm normally not a light gray girl, but I do like this one. And then I like the cuff, how long that is. And it's a little different than the rest of the sleeve. It's a thinner sweater, which I appreciate. The hem, it's just got a little, just a little bit of a hem on it. I don't know, I kind of like it, but I already have a style like this. What am I gonna do? I don't know. It depends on the price and what you guys think. Okay, so obviously you guys know I like this, but do I need another one? I don't know. Okay, we have one more item to try on, and that are the boots, so I'll be back. Last item, let's give them a try and hope that they fit because they are adorable. Okay, as cute as these are, they are definitely too big in the calf. Look how wide that is. Not sure how well you guys can see that. Just gonna put it down, look at that. Yeah, I definitely don't have wide calves, but they sure are cute boat boots. Could have been a good possibility. I like the buckle on it here. So the heel's good. So as you could tell, the boots are gonna be a no. The calf on them are just way too big. So let's just, I'm gonna get comfy on the couch and let's do a quick review. I'll give you my thoughts of each item and I'll give you the prices. I'm anxious to see those prices myself. Oh boy, that was a great trunk. Hannah did a great job getting my style. And originally I had asked for a trunk full of just, I just wanted sale item items only. That's all I want her to send me or a majority of sale items. I told her she could send me pants, shoes, whatever she wanted. She sent me a message with my first preview and she said, I'm really sorry. She said, I couldn't find that many things that I thought you would like that are on sale. I think there was a couple things in there, but I declined them. And she was right. She could have just stuffed the trunk 
with a lot of sale item things that I probably wouldn't have liked, but she didn't do that. So I don't think any of these are on sale, but you never know till you check out. Maybe they'll go on sale with any luck. Okay, so let's start with, oh, I wanna tell you also, before I forget, I'm gonna tell you my thoughts of these items, but once I see the video and hear your comments, um, I will make a final decision and I will post in my um, vlog, we, I do a weekly vlog on, let's see, Saturday, February the 15th. You'll see exactly what I end up keeping, or I'll, tell, I'll show you what I end up keeping in that uh, vlog. Because sometimes I'll say, these are a keeper. I watch a video and I'm like, no, I'm not keeping those. So anyways, all right, the boots. The boots are definitely going back. These are called the Troy 2 Knee High Boots. They're $119.95. Those are being returned, obvious reasons. The cap is way too big. Otherwise, I really like them. All right, Hannah, if you're watching, I appreciate you sending these to me. And actually, I think she had also a pink pair in my preview and I declined them because on the model, they looked shorter. I don't typically like ankle pants. These are a little bit longer and they only look longer on the model wearing the gray. So I went ahead and I accepted these and I declined the pink. So um, these are $109, but they fit me. Um, unless the video shows differently, they are the Curves 360 by NYDJ. So I think I'd probably prefer a different color, but I think I'm gonna keep these. What do you guys think? Let me know, because they fit. And I'm telling you, all my other clothes, my jeans, are so tight and so uncomfortable other than the ones that I have on that are by Wit and Wisdom. And I have told you guys this before, I love these. They're the Ab Solution. They are the boot cut and they fit me. The, the waist is a little, is stretchy. So it kind of expands as I'm expanding and shifting a little bit. So it helps and they're comfortable. So when I sit down, they don't fall down in the back. All right, so. I, did I, I have to see if I did the sit down test in these. Uh, because there's a girl that I watch, Sue, from Senior Citizen Sue. She's so funny. She was talking about doing the sit down test. So thank you, Sue, for that reminder. So I'll do that. All right, Cece, this is so cute. How much is this? $79 for this top. And I like it a lot but I think because of how light the color is and everything, it just shows um, the shift in my weight a little bit too much for my comfort zone. So for right now, I'm gonna say no, pretty much no to this top, but I'm gonna keep my eye on it because I think I also would need to size up and maybe if um, once I start working and, and eating right, not working, walking and eating right, you know, um, this would be more of a possibility. I'm just not comfortable in it. You gotta be comfortable in your clothes. Whatever you decide that you like, that you feel good in, that's what you should wear. All right, J. Crew. This top is really cute, $69, it's a sweater, but it's scratchy. The more I had it on, the scratchier it, it felt. So um, it would be a nice, just simple, basic, top to have on hand, but because it doesn't feel scratchy in my hands, but wearing it, it did. So for that reason, this I'm probably not gonna keep. Okay, Tommy Hilfiger. I'm intrigued by this top. What do you guys think of this? How much is this? This is $69. And I think for right now, I'm gonna say no. I just, I just keep thinking I should be tucking a baby in there. I, what do you guys think? I mean, it's different, it's interesting. Oh, I'm kind of on the fence for $69. If it was on sale, I would think harder about keeping it. But for right now, this is probably gonna be a no. All right, the other Tommy Hilfiger. This one is really cute. This one is $69 also, but I would need to size up in this. This was just too tight on me. So I might size up in this. I thought it was, I thought it was cute. What do you guys think? 
It's a nice simple top. I'd get a lot of wear out of it. So I probably will for $69, I'll get my money's worth out of it. So I'll see if I can size up in that. Of course I could change my mind. Oh, oh my gosh, who's this by? This is the Hologen. Okay, honestly, you guys, do you like this top? This is the one that's uh, solid in the back with the lace in the front and the lace sleeves. How cute is this? How much is this? $49. It's only $49. Yeah, it's a keeper. This is definitely a keeper. Okay, I wanted to show you the back. This is the closure on the back of it. And it's got, actually, yeah. I don't know, it's pretty cute. Uh, I don't know how much wear I'd get out of it, but, because it does look a little fancier. I don't know, I like it. $49, I'm probably gonna keep that. All right, now let's talk about this uh, Rachel Parcel top that is very similar to the one I just showed you. I love it. How much is this? Rachel, Rachel, where are you? Uh, the mixed top, $59. I mean, the Tommy Hilfiger shirt, $69. So $59 sounds pretty good. I like it a lot. I, I like it. What do you guys think? I don't know. I'd wear it with jeans. I'd put it on. You'll see me in a video and you'll probably be like, she's got that top on again. <laughs> yep. Okay, this top is by, who is this one by? Oh, Bowden. Um, $55. It is a Judith jersey top, and it's very interesting. I have to watch the video. I, I think I need to size up in it. It has the boat neck, which I really like. Uh, navy with this gold shimmer. I don't, it's, a, it's an interesting top. That's what I like about it. And it's only $55. I say only, but I mean, in comparison with the Tommy Hill figure top for $69, I guess that's what I'm comparing it to. I don't know, what do you guys think? I have to watch the video back. I'm kind of on the fence with this one, but I like it. I wish there was a volume discount. We make it so much easier. Oh gosh, here we go. This is the Rachel Barcel, uh, Parcel top, the sweater just like the top I have on. How much is this? This one is ooh, $75. Mm, I don't know. And it's hand wash. I would probably wash it in with my delicates and then lay it out, but oh, I don't know. It'll look good with the gray jeans if I keep those, Didn't, don't you think? Hmm. I don't know, I like it. Oh, did I tell you the white CC top was $79, the very first one with the bow? I'm not sure if I told you that. Okay, you guys, that's it. What do you guys think? Honestly, I know you guys will be honest with me. And again, all, all the items and the prices are in the description. And please watch my weekly vlog that will post on Saturday, December or February the 15th. And you'll get an update on the items I actually kept. So... That's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching. And Hannah, my stylist, if you're watching, thank you, thank you very much. You did another great job with my trunk and I very much appreciate it. So that's all I have for you today. Everyone have a wonderful morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are, from my home to yours. Honestly, the arm, what do you call this? Um, What do you call this? This is not the hem. This is the, cup, called the cup, right? Let's we'll start over.